the startup, you have to learn how to outsource because you can't just manage everything yourself. You know what? I have a lot of work to do. I got so many projects, so many websites, so many email blast listing pro projects that I have to send out. Riding a crazy camel, doing some breakdowns. It's too much stuff. I mean, how would you handle that? I mean, as a business owner, how would you do that? I mean, it, I know we can wear all kinds of hats to do different things. Initially, yes, but as you grow, you gotta let it go. If you go to Fiverr, the, the way that it worked for me, that I was looking for any freelancer that got like five stars rating system, look at their time of the delivery and any extra gigs that they offer within their typical price of $5, you know, a different project. You'd be surprised you can do anything from proofreading, uh, graphics, animations, video animations, and whatnot. So when you do that, make sure you hire at least three freelancers for one project so you can find out which one, you know, got the best result. If you look at Odesk and Elance, also people per hour, you will find expert, talented, talented uh, folks and expert and freelancers from locally and also internationally. And the cool thing about those systems, you can actually post your project and it works like eBay where every freelancer will basically bid for, for them to hire, so you can hire them basically, okay? But when you write those project when you post those project make sure you keep it concise and detailed and ask few questions to make sure that whoever reads it actually does read the post and answer this question for you then you would know that they didn't just you know pick your project just for the heck of it does that make sense and you also have to look uh, if they are individual freelancers or are they part of an agency and uh, and just you know hire them and do a couple of tests and don't forget to use skype to interview them. Another option would be places, uh, co-working spaces like, you know, Geekdom, like this awesome place, Traffic Commerce, uh, Venture Point or Park Up City, you will find other experts in those areas so you can visit and hire them to basically help you with this you know, different project. At the end of the day, you need to realize that in most cases, you can't just run everything by yourself. Initially, yes, we all do that, but you have to figure out how you can spend minimum time to spend 100% of your focus on the business and let the rest of the other project run by somebody else. That way, you'll have more time to spend with your family and friends, right? So there you go, folks. If you have tried anything else or any other links on outsourcing, please comment below. And don't forget, Odesk, Elance, Fuel Hour, Iver, Thumbtack, and 1990Sign, all of them has been useful. Now, let me leave this thought with you. Coming together is the beginning. Keeping it together is a progress, and working together is success by Henry Ford. It's done! You're gonna put junk on my demo? Alright.